I'm getting there slowly in that toolbox kind of forlorn. I don't know what the length of this might be. I don't got a tape measure. Well, I probably got about 40 of them, but Lord only knows where they are. Let's see, I got the length of that. Snowbrush, which actually belongs in the car, but <laughs> I ended up using my driver's license or whatnot to go and scrape it off the windshield. So let's see. Will it fit? Got that much extra space. Let's go back over there again. Will it fit on top of us? Well, it looks like it might. I can imagine most of you guys would have this place uh put together already long ago Woo. that came down pretty hard there's a voice right there there's a few tools in here flip phone some whatnot <clears throat> I'll put that over there I mean look at that this is the way I love tools everywhere <clears throat> you guys got me throwing noodles all over the place some are frozen in the ice <laughs> 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 Ooh, close fit. Perfect fit, look at that. <sighs> Perfect fit. Maybe you could pound that den out of there. That's probably for me standing on it. Perfectly good toolbox. Another flip phone. Who knows what's in here? Probably some drill boots. Got one of these. I've been looking for one of these that fits the front of my house outlet for years. I don't know if that one will fit. There's some spoons and forks. We don't have any in our house, really, that, not too many. We eat out all the time, or not all the time, I'm exaggerating. There's a star, I don't know what that's from. There's another charger thing. So as you can see, it really wasn't being used very much for brake pads <clears throat> time to start organizing I guess right a little notepad from one of my kids probably another brake pad already opened that one already opened that one alright 
clean everything that's in here, I guess. <clears throat> Getting there slowly, slowly. This needs to be completely redone. Going over. I don't know how I. Well, the camera doesn't show it very well, but let's see if I can put my fingers in the way of that. Only one of the light bulbs is working. See how that's like that? One's burnt out. <sighs> Inching along. We're not moving very fast, are we? We're just crawling along here in life. Going so slow that we're, I'm still actually going backwards. When you're moving at my speed, even if you're making progress, if you go too slow, you're actually sliding backwards. These, I gotta cut these. Huh. Man, I got my work cut out for me. What did I do to myself? <laughs> Everything you see here is all work. Something needs to be done. And uh, now that I have the dumpster, I have to, I have to produce or they're gonna want the dumpster back. So then, it's like a vicious cycle. Then I'll be stuck using my pickup trucks once again. And then the scrap will build up because the pickup truck's not enough to sustain a family. To sustain, sustain one scrapper, doing it as a hobby, sure. But not really. Not really something you can live off of. Actually looks like a license plate bracket thing. What are you gonna do with that? You're hoarding that. Yes, I am. That light fixture I found works, but I wouldn't know where to put that thing. Where the heck could I put that? You know, I was thinking put it on that and that support column right there. The man is stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, mentally I'm stuck. And I don't seem to be able to get unstuck. I keep getting... I make progress a little bit. It's not enough. No matter what I do every day. No matter how hard I work or don't work. It doesn't seem like... Here, put it this way. The amount I produce each day gets completely consumed. So it's like, I'm no further ahead. Like, if I could like triple the production somehow, triple the amount of scrap that we actually consume the value out of, then progress would be happening slowly. I can't remember what I did with the, the drill. But that's... There it is. That's the problem here. So I'm just all fascinated that I got that on there. So the dream was to like actually make this into like a little, like a shed. This area right here. You know, and put like a roof on it. And then I could put hoard life on top or whatever I wanted to like save and all that. But that never happened. That was supposed to happen last year. But uh... For whatever reason, there's, there's only 24 hours in the day. We don't want to hear the doom and gloom. That's what I'm trying to explain to you all. And that be fake. Like, uh, what the deal is here. So I tried to get the wife to call on those two signs that I had, and she wouldn't do it. 
thing. I don't know how to, I don't know how to wheel and deal. I'm like, that's part of the reason why we're poor. You don't know how to wheel and deal, or you don't want to. I don't know, maybe her conscience bothers her, like, she thinks she's ripping somebody off, because they're the kind of people, which is not bad, but my wife's family is the kind of people that would just bring the thing back. No questions asked, no deal to be had, nothing. And I'm the kind of person that would be like, man, I found this for you, it could have been in the garbage. It's my time, what you going to give me for? That's why you're behind it, Life King. Maybe. Do something without expecting anything. We could do that. I just choose not to. All right. Because <clears throat> that's part of lazy or hard working, right? And uh, you don't get a mammoth stomach like this from being hard working, you get it from lazy. <sighs> Actually, that pile has gotten smaller, believe it or not. What's in that pile? Uh, there's some garbage in there. There's a lot of plasticky sh Chinooks. There's some aluminum. What's over here? Car parts, tires, keep life, whatnot, yada yada, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Stuff I wanted to sell, but yeah, that hasn't happened ever. What's over here? Save life, keep life. More noodles. Yep. More noodles. Stuff to pick apart here still. A deep freezer that works. A 120 volt dryer that works. I don't know. Sometimes when I come here and look at my own junk here, <laughs> I like, uh, uh, I did this to me. But there's reasons why I did this to me. It's because I'm not competitive. If you put me out there on the road, head to head with another scrapper, I will lose 100% of the time because there'll be refrigerators and water heaters on that block. And there'll be a broom handle on that block. And that scrapper that I'm competing with We'll turn that way where the water heaters are, and I'll turn this way where the broom handle is. Partly because I drive slow. <clears throat> I drive slow because I'm cautious. Otherwise, if I wasn't cautious, then I would end up like... I would end up like... Uh, let's take a little peeky boo end up like so many other people. Let's take a little peekaboo. I would end up like that guy right there. Slip sliding away on the ice and the snow. Something with large paws came through here. What else they got back there? I can't really see, but yep. A lot of unfortunate things there. Is that my shoe? Shoe print? No, it's somebody else. Yep. Somebody else that went walking around back here. They didn't go any further. <clears throat> I 
Oh yeah, look at this guy. Look at that car. Wow. So that's why I'm cautious. I don't want to end up like that guy. Late model Impala there, all smashed up. <clears throat> oh yeah, I can see uh, K and E scrapping. Probably looking at this monster. I watched this video where he tore apart the the dishwasher electric motor. That's a lot of work there, dude. That's a lot of copper in there, though. That's a lot of copper in there, and that's why I haven't scrapped it yet. Because, uh... What a terrific waste that would be just to punch that in the, in the shred pile. <clears throat> Why am I making this video? I don't know. Why not, right? Because I have a channel. And I kind of feel stymied by this, uh, by this weather here. Everything frozen. Cleaned all of them up. And cut them up still. Supposedly that stupid thing works, but couldn't get it to fire up. Yeah, you've seen that already. This is stuff to slip over. <sighs> all right. Well, another compound video. I hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna keep plugging away at this mountain of work that I have. Here we're not even halfway through winter. See ya. <laughs>